Shepard, the intel you sent looks good. The fleets are ready to go. But? Once we're committed against Cerberus, it won't be long before the Reapers take notice. And the Crucible? Ready. Except for the Catalyst. But there's no way to hide the ships we'll be sending at Cerberus. Once we attack, the Crucible won't stay safe for long. For all intents and purposes, an assault on Cerberus will be the first stage of our attack on Earth. What happens if Cerberus doesn't have the intel we need? Or they stop us from getting it? Then we lead the fleets to Earth and we take our chances. But your intel points to Cerberus and the elusive man holding the information we're looking for. And... we have the element of surprise. Cerberus won't know what hit him. The Reapers and Cerberus started this. Now we're gonna end it. I'll get the fleets mobilized. Shepard, we've arrived. The crew is waiting. The strike team is in. We've got our foothold. Fifth Fleet, all forward. I don't want a single server ship in my sky when we're through. Shepard, I should accompany you on this mission. Why? This is the central point of operations for Cerberus. They will have enhanced security measures. With my knowledge of Cerberus algorithms and this body's updated protocols, I offer the best chance to help you succeed. Grab your gear.
Joker, what's our status? We've got a foothold, but it's not much, Commander. A lot of fighters guarding the launch base. Can you get us in? It won't be a problem, Commander. Shepard, I am ready. You're taking Edie into Cerberus headquarters? I will be fine, Jeff. Head to the shuttle, Edie. Fifth Fleet's cut through their line. They're regrouping. Now's as good a time as any. Be ready to take us in. Roger that. Find a console and stop surfers from venting the hangar. Shepard, we're almost out of time. Find a console before Cerberus vents the hangar.
Shepard, we need to find a console and stop servers from venting the hangar. Edie, I've got a console. Go! Hangar vent procedure. Disabled. Can you open the hangar? No. However, I can access their fighter launch controls. Shepard, Cerberus is aware that the venting attempt failed. Reinforcements are inbound. Launching fighter. Impressive! The central lab was located behind this hangar. I suggest we follow the fighter's path. Noted. Let's move.
Edie, can you get past it? One moment. Cerberus has updated their encryption. There may be a slight delay as I bypass security. How's Cerberus reacting to us breaching the door? They are sealing off as much of the base as they can. Most obvious routes to the central lab are blocked. Other areas are being fortified. Heavy troopers will attempt to delay us while engineers set up turrets. Any more surprises like venting the hangar? No. I am aware of this facility's safeguards and can counteract them. Cerberus can merely slow us down. Let me know when you're through. I am through. We must proceed through a sublevel to avoid Cerberus containment measures. Where do you think we'll find the Prothean VI? A central lab at the heart of this facility. It is the most secure area. Following the destruction left by the fighter will offer the most direct route. Engineers are currently preparing an organized defense ahead. They can waste that many troops? Yes. Cerberus employs Reaper augmentation on captured civilians to create functional shock troops quickly. I assumed they were volunteers, scared and looking for answers. This is... horrible. Yes. We will be through momentarily. Shepard, that console has not been fully scrubbed. It contains data you may find interesting. What am I looking at? Project Lazarus, your reconstruction. It can't be done. It's not a matter of resources. It's always a matter of resources. We're not losing Shepard. Sir, Shepard is clinically brain dead. After that much trauma, that long with no oxygen, we cannot overcome nature. Operative Lawson disagrees. She is now in charge of Project Lazarus. I didn't realize it was that bad. I saw what was left of you. I thought you knew. Are you all right? I'm still me. I doubt I'd have been able to turn against Cerberus otherwise. I don't remember anything. Maybe they really just fixed me, or... Maybe I'm just a high-tech VI that thinks it's Commander Shepard. I don't know why. I'd be surprised if it didn't unnerve you. Tissue regeneration is proceeding. The helmet kept the brain intact for whatever good that will do. Lawson will find a way. Sir, Shepard's an Alliance soldier. As far as he knows, we're a terrorist organization. Shepard's a soldier. He knows the Reapers are the real threat. He'll work with us. He was an excellent judge of character. The Alliance wasn't listening. 
What the hell was I supposed to do? Sit and wait? You did what was necessary, and now you'll take him down. Project Lazarus is reporting neurological activity. They're requesting more funding. Granted. Get me our potential recruits file. Shepard will be up soon. We need a crew. Our existing forces should be more than sufficient. No. We need sympathetic faces. I need Shepard invested. Tap Kelly Chambers and recruit Donnelly. I imagine Miss Daniels will follow. We want some old friends as well. Contact Dr. Chakwas and send me the psych profile on Shepard's pilot, along with a bottle of 47 Thessia Red. He populated the Normandy with friendly faces, so you never saw Cerberus for what it was. How's that door coming, Edie? We are clear to proceed. Pylon. The portable barrier generator is on the right. 
I will bypass the lock. If you are interested, the console nearby is still functional. VI on Luna? Yes. Guess we didn't exactly get off on the right foot. It was difficult. Gaining awareness while under attack was confusing. I am pleased that my relationship with Organics has become more cooperative. Our sims indicate that the enhanced defense intelligence gives the highest combat improvement on frigates. Anything heavier, and the ships react too slowly to benefit from Edie's advice. Edie? Oh, that's, uh, it, well, the boys in the lab came up with a name for her. For it. Good work. I'll take your recommendations on planned installation. Sir, she, it, can be very persuasive. If it were to turn a crewman, convince them to disable the shackles, well... It's a cyber warfare suite, Doctor. Nothing more. Shows what he knew. It is unlikely that anyone without Jeff's extreme emotional attachment to his ship would have been willing to unshackle me. I don't know. With that voice? What about the backups? I'm sorry, sir. None of Normandy's surveillance feeds have been responding since Shepard went rogue. I want it back. Retry the remote lockdown protocols. After our last attempt, Edie flooded our server with seven zettabytes of explicit images. I think she was making a joke. It doesn't make jokes, Doctor. Allocate a team for a new project. Codename Eva. This time, we'll ensure it stays loyal. You never told me about servers trying to shut down the Normandy. You had more pressing issues. The situation was under control. Seven zettabytes? Most of it was Jeff's. That was... A joke. I know. And thank you. 